Welcome back, everyone, to the Amber Throne. I'm your host, Mr. Gazillion, and in the last episode, we broke the game. That's right, we broke it. We did things that we shouldn't have done, but now it makes the game all that much um, easier, I guess. It's not a bad thing, considering these monsters are actually pretty freaking tough. Oh yeah, we did learn mud, uh, mud, mud sling or whatever this is called. I've got Thunder Spire, which is supposed to do a lot of thunder damage. There we go. Steel Boomerang on this one, maybe a... Like, I do a lot of these things, I don't really know what it does, really. Horizon's probably going to be a good one. There you go, 2000. There you go. That one resisted. Solar Storm on one of them. Oh no, it's both of them. Good. And, uh, Spike Shot. Like, I really don't know what to do anymore, like... Everything is... Here, let's do Spike Shot and hopefully we can finish both of them. Uh, maybe not. Uh, not close. Close, but n not finished. This, this should do it, though. Even though she resists... Ara is absolutely monstrous now, with her near maxed out attack power. I am right. Maybe, but I'm over leveled. So, boo, hoo, hoo. No, 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 that's not what I. Ah, dang, it's too late. I want to break your defense. Come on, break it. Defense down, perfect. Attack down, that's okay, because I'm going to do Solar Strike. Uh, to an enemy. No, I won't do one to all enemies. There you go. Bloom, perfect, thank you. And uh, just keep doing this, I suppose. I think... Sira now has a ability that makes his regular weapons uh, lightning based. So I'm gonna try just. Ah, oh, well, that's not very nice. So I'm gonna try just a regular attack out of curiosity, really. And that was absolutely useless. And so was that. Scissor slash, ow, but nulled for by her, of course, because her defense is monstrous. Because <laughs> we also overleveled her defense. Too funny. That should do the trick, though. Come on, kill her. There you go. Alright, I forget. Does poison go away after battles? I think it does. And... What does it look like? Yeah, no poisons here. Now, I want to talk to this one. You don't need to go further. Everything is here. Stay. Let's listen to what she has to say. Not. <laughs> Not. Uh, let's just do Steel Boomerang. We'll do one Star Breaker. 3,000 defense down. That's exactly what I want to see. See? Like, she, she's, she's the last one to attack. And she takes a lot of damage. Just, honestly, just a regular attack. I don't really feel like going through the animations. So she doesn't get to attack very often. Sometimes she does attack, but you get 2,000 gold per... Isn't it easy? You can have all of this world. Um, yeah, so basically, I was pressing Z every 200 milliseconds, which is probably faster than when I press it when I'm battling. It just makes for some really easy battle, honestly. Hmm. What's here? I don't really know where I'm going. I don't know what I'm looking for. Can I go in this ship? Let's check it out from over here, maybe. No, I don't think so. How about this downed one over there? No. Same thing. We're stuck here. There's an invisible wall. For some reason, there's an invisible wall. Okay. Where do you want me to go, Amber Throne? Tell me! 
And I will go. Down here. There I go. I think that's the right path. Oh, does it want us to go down? I'm just going to check the left here just in case, I guess. Because this, does that load something? Oh, we're going to go underground, of course. Yes, okay. I'm okay with that. Oh, yeah, there was a guy here. Oh, no, there wasn't. Oh, that was the other ruins. He was searching for a black sword that could kill. Oh, we already found it, actually. It was actually on the floaty castle. Not a floaty castle, but it was in Ax Axis's kingdom. And there's nothing here, so... Just more of the same. Alright. Come on, let's get it going. Evelyn, make this a fair fight. Come and come to us. You're all powerful. Why are you making me come to you? This is ridiculous. Why you didn't wipe me out when you had the chances beyond me? Wait. What? Where am I supposed to go? Where the heck? Can I walk on this route? Doesn't seem like it. Where am I supposed to go? What is this? What is this baloney? Can I go to the left? Is that where I'm supposed to go? Didn't I try that already? I thought I did. Hmm. Do I have to walk up on this? What the heck? This is not the most intuitive map, people. As much as I I enjoyed this game, these inv why is there an invisible wall here? Why can't I walk up? That's frustrating. All right, let's see here. Walk up and to the left here, maybe. Follow the roots or something. Ah, that looks like a, there you go. Not very clear, but we got it. I don't remember seeing this before. Hmm. The Red City. Okay. That sounds right. Uh, invisible wall galore. Oh, what did I fight? I didn't see anything. Oh, okay. Whoops, never mind. You, a traitor to your world. A traitor? What's become of my soldiers? Of what am I guilty? What? Acting against our goddess Evelyn, progenitor of Axis, the throne's holy ladle. Ladle? 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 ladle I don't know. What manner of insanity is this, goddess? What have you done with the princess? Oh, there he is, right next to me. Everything will make sense soon. This wealth just is no longer in your hands. Vile ones, you've avoided these nasty tendrils. The kingdom is being woven beneath them. They've taken my soldiers from me. I fear our people will soon follow. Harpsichord spoke of this. I thought him a rambling old fool. That if the fears of the throne were true, we'd be without hope. Is this truly our fate? For the protection of the goddess, your hands must be stayed. This is not regrettable. It is the day you truly return to the earth. Well, maybe, uh, maybe Okair will join us now. And this guy is Dunzo. There we go, a little bit of slashing damage. Ooh, attack up, really? A little bit of one-shot kill. Yes, that's right. The... the root. So it is, has come to this. Worse, were we so blind? Perhaps the old knew something we've not yet figured out. That there was a reason the throne had to be bound from us. Yet, perhaps it is better this way, that we finally confront it. Oh no, Okair! No! I'll avenge you. You had the 
You, you know, you had noble intentions. You wanted the best for your people. I know you weren't evil. Even Evelyn is not truly evil. The throne is the only evil here. Hmm, a treasure. That's odd. Everyone's dead. Don't need anything offered by the throne. Two revives. Uh-oh. Never a good sign. Those roots won't grow in us too, will they? I don't want any. Hey, you. You're that foreigner who came to the city. You have to be. I'd never forget that weird crown on your head. Everyone's been swallowed up by these plants. It's like the world is coming to an underneath, uh, up underneath us. But you're here. The plants didn't get you. Everyone lies. The king, the sages. Even Evelyn. How can you trust anybody? Maybe they were right. We should join these roots. Don't say stupid things. I don't like them any more than you. Those filthy lizards, too. But you can't grow up hating and being afraid of everything. But what can we do? Everything's too hard. You can beat up the hard things. Nothing's hard after a couple of whoopins. <laughs> whoopins, not whoopins. Even these roots? Especially these roots. If we pull a, if we pull hard enough, they might unravel. Are, are you sure? Positive. Well, come on, we've got our own roots to unravel, don't we? We do. We really do. If we can't have fields and flowers without these roots, I don't want them. I don't want to end up like that. If we just pull a little harder, that's right. Pull as hard as you can, folks. What's in this treasure box? We've got three full potions. Huzzah. Alright. Any way we can free anyone? I want to pull up some roots. Um, that's the castle. Is it? Just going to make sure there's no like areas we can explore and get another treasure. The Red Castle. Why do I have a feeling this is the final dungeon? It's only a feeling. I've had that feeling before and I was wrong, so... Oh, well, look at that. It's Evelyn. Well, you'll look at that. Look at it. This is where the king was murdered, and we ran away to the left here, but the left path has crumbled. Oh, can we go down there? Beneath? That looks like... No, that's a wall. That's definitely a wall. Doesn't look different than the rest of the, the other things. Okay, now we're going to climb up the route. Uh, the god route. Up to the Amber Throne again. Are we going to meet the Emperor? Or is there anyone else we can meet? Maybe I should have stayed in Goldwood. Shut up, Evelyn. You're dead. Destroy the Amber Throne. You can break free of its hold. We're just going to try and see if there's a treasure here or anything, really. I'm not a hero. I'm the one who betrayed his people. What? I guess, is this the voice of the different people who took on the Amber Throne? Hey, look, I see a face right here. Faces and places. If I uh, if I ended this, you would have you would forgive me, wouldn't you? Of course I would. Evelyn, come on, come back, snap out of it. You don't have to do this. You, we can still destroy the Amber Throne. It's not too late. Not yet, anyway. Don't make it harder, Evelyn. Where are you? Come on. Show yourself. Doesn't need to be this way. We're sisters, after all. Our father wanted us to destroy the Amber Throne. Those were his dying wishes.
There's her face again. And her face here again. Evelyn. Papa, she's back. She's horrible, isn't she? Fighting and fighting. Why? Why won't you speak to me? I needed you. We needed each other. Please come back. I completed maturity. I was your tree, your angel. It's all your fault. You can talk. I hear you. You said you were dead. You're a liar. Why can't you just leave me alone? Stop reminding me of things I don't want to remember. I just want you to shut up. Everything's complete. We succeeded. Nothing is left to fear. The sky is no longer a black desert. We've all joined its beautiful garden. Don't you understand? This world's hopeless. We're hopeless. I'm hopeless. I tire of this woe. I can't do anything by myself. You've left me with nothing but despair. I want you back. I want it all back. That's our wish. That's my wish to save us. Stop reminding me I can't take it anymore. Uh-oh. That's not good. This world. It's mine to save. Hmm. Is this the final battle or is this just almost the final battle? Well, that looks very final to me. Uh-oh. And... That's music that I've never heard. Well, let's star break it, I guess. Symphony, huh? I don't know what that means, symphony. Well, it's not weak against slashing. Let's throw a thunder. I feel like a tree would be weak against thunder. Did we defense down? No. Let's try just slowing it down then. Ow. 5,000. Spike shot, maybe. And, uh... I don't know what Symphony does. I would like it to go away. Um... Let's root change into a root wall. Well, I'm gonna guess that a root wall can be broken up with a star breaker. There you go. Yes, it did. I'm gonna do a steel boomerang. And I'm going to do a solar strike, because that one does fire and lightning. Still! Not... Ugh, come on. Papel, can you do something that's... Maybe a mud bomb. I just... Maybe a regular skin just end it. There you go. She res resisted, but that's fine. Alright, we didn't gain very good XP here, so it's not over. That was not her true form. Uh, okay, looking up. Ooh, those are... Oh, those are all of Axis's daughters, aren't they? Kind of sad and scary. Uh, one mo. Can we slow it down? Let's try and slow it down with the horizon. Ow. Sludge. That's good. Uh, that didn't work. And I got a lunar strike or something. This one may lower each agility. Deals damage all. Okay, this one might de lower defense. It did. Um, let's try and see if Slash is any good. Ah, whoops. Ah, actually, you know what? Piercing is fine. That's close to 2,000 damage right there. And let's just try a regular attack. 4,000, that's pretty good. Wow. Aura's defense is so powerful, it's dodging pretty much everything. Agility down. Spike shot. It's kind of sad. This probably this was probably supposed to be a pretty tough fight from the get go. I would I mean, there we go. And still mediocre, so not the final battle. 
Oh, this looks a bit more final. Looks like Evelyn holding axes, probably? What is she holding? Yeah, I would say that that's axis. Uh, spike shot for now. Oh, I should have done mud, whatever. It's not particularly powerful, but you know, could have helped. A little Starbreaker. All right. Ovum changed to Ovum. Let's try and lower its agility. It worked. Let's try and slow it even down. Even more. Sludge, come on, yes. And I'm going to do a... Let's try and delay the target. Oh, wow. That... Still, though, not the final battle. Yeah, that world slash was pretty freaking powerful. Instead, we're gonna climb back to the top. You know what? We should probably heal up. Not that we really need it. Actually, we kind of do. Those those are big numbers, <laughs> despite not percentage-wise, we're almost full. But so, the conditions are met. Oh, Evelyn, I don't want to kill you. Just let us destroy the... Isn't it beautiful? This is our destiny. To return to this garden at the helm of our existence. Oh, here lies eternal silence. Perfect to hear your thoughts. Where our words linger forever. Where divine inspiration is born and, uh, and dies. Flowers dancing endlessly across the abyss. Utopia. You're full of it. I don't care about your insane rambling. The throne is tearing our world apart. Look at that. That is definitely destroyed. Here's Arcanaut. We can't be letting go of our destinies, can we? These are the fates chosen by us by the stars, after all. All of us are part of the same heavenly body. Father gave us life to decide this fate for ourselves. He groomed us to understand the many reasons for the throne's belonging. We were tools in his struggle to understand. Sacrifices. Now the conditions are met to remain and his, his answer will finally be given so do we embrace the throne or do we destroy it over and over the same mistake wallowing in our hopeless land there's the throne if only we'd obey its hymns when your wishes come true that is what we live for I'm going to make them all come true. Because I am this world's angel, the one to bring its true closure. Well... We're fighting a naked Evelyn. Let's sludge her up. Let's take away her defense. Black sword versus white sword. There you go, defense gone. Let's sludge her up. She's so sludged up. Now let's slow her down. There you go. Now spike shot. Oh, big slash. Doesn't hurt that much. We're gonna do another world slash, I think. Because it's a large amount of damage. Oh, I think every time we hit her now, she... Oh, no, maybe not, actually. Bam! 9,000. Oh, what's this move? Oh, she's almost defeated. That was, uh... Let's mud shot her again. And I'm gonna do n another world slash. Oh, 
Bam. <laughs> no screwing around. Evelyn, you didn't have time to say your dialogue in this battle, did you? Oh no, that's not good. We ripped the amber throne from her chest. Please end this child. Come into my arms, listen to my voice. Oh, calm, silence. Good. What's going on? Let's take it out. Oh, where's our crown? Where are we walking to? I'm not controlling this. There's our crown. This belongs to you, does it not? My... my crown? My voice! Oh, who's wearing the crown now? I can... It was for your own good. You were headed down a dangerous path. You cannot be damned to such a fate. But father was going to crown himself. Of course, access to be... access to began down that path. He was the one who allowed this, was he not? Come, young one. I trust in you to make the right choice. I'm not going to make the right choice, then. Above you is an abyss, to one filled with pain, with demons. I don't care. I'll destroy them, too. There you go. Maybe a little world slash on this dragon. Oh, we have the crown again. Ho! Oh, one shot. Take that, dragon. Ooh, yeah. I am trying to help you. Why don't you understand? Understand this, dragon. The time of the Amber Throne is over. I see. Perhaps it is time for humans to be released then. Countless eternities incomplete. They've decided for themselves. So be it. Oh, snap. Hara, you are a cool protagonist. There's a reason why you're a silent protagonist. And so the Amber Throne is destroyed. Back to where it came. So, how's the world doing? This wasn't it? It's over. We're free from that disease. This is our world now. One we are responsible for cultivating. This wasn't... my destiny? Great timing! The damn plants rotting underneath us! We've got to get down before everything collapses. Obviously, come on, Era. Forget about Evelyn. Let's get back to our desert. No, no, no. Bring Evelyn. No, we're going back for her. There's no way we're leaving her. What? No, 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 no. Damn it, I wanted to go back for her. Why can't we go back and save her? That was Lame. We've abandoned our sister. I don't feel good about that one. She also thought she was doing this, the right thing for us. I feel a little bad that we one-shotted the bosses. World Slash is kind of OP when your character is OP themselves. All right, let's get out of here before everything collapses again. <clears throat> this is not good. Let's get out of here. Uh oh. This side? Ooh. Let's jump here then. Wait. 
Wait, we can't get by? Where are we supposed to go then? Oh, just around. Whoops, my bad. Oh god. Not looking too good, guys. Let's hurry up before we're, before, before we're locked out. Ara, what's wrong? Hurry, daughter of Axis, we mustn't stay. Save her. Come on, Ara, save her. It won't matter anyway. Ara, come on. We can still make it. We're not doing this without you. Oh, now you pretty much have to. It never mattered. We'll rot. It's all over. Come on, Evelyn, stop this. Come on, Evelyn, stop it. I don't want to hurt you. Can I avoid this? Nah. You've left me no choice. I was hoping to let you live. Oh. That's not good. What a shame. The world will have to learn to live without beautiful things. Hmm. Did Arrow die? Evelyn's been stabbed pretty badly. She's probably dead. Hurry, we must get a move on. I... I don't think we've much longer left. Come, humans. But Ara, we're not doing this without her. We don't have much of a choice, pig. She handled everything else, didn't she? Whether we stay or leave, she's finished. That's what she wanted. Ara, come on! This isn't what I wanted. Oh, Papel. Leaving her hood behind. Come on, Ara, step out of there. Come on. Step out of there. Please. Well, there's the throne that uh, Evelyn sat on, falling apart. Oh. Kind of sad. You know, Evelyn was just doing what she thought was best. Each morning, days get longer, the sun shines longer, the walls get hotter. Oh, Papel's all grown up, I think. Fourth Kings once said that all the things use fuel to produce more fuel. That's the divide, right? Is it? For a long time, we were the thrones. <laughs> There's Ara at the top there. Was that on purpose? But if we somehow manage to survive in this world we've chosen... I wonder if perhaps we weren't. I wonder if that crown still works.
It's been done then. The world's fate is sealed. And I don't quite know if it's good or bad. But it's been done. Well, there you go. There you have it. The end of the Amber Throne. I really enjoyed this game. I enjoyed the battle system. It's crazy that this was done in RPG Maker. Um, wow. This is... I'm Yeah, I'm pretty lucky to have played two great JRPGs, indie JRPGs in a row. I don't think... I'll be able to find many more RPG Maker games that are that are of this caliber. I mean, look at all these. The crown, but that's impossible. Ara couldn't have removed it. The throne takes its own with it. Its own? But that would mean Axis's daughters were. That's all then. Forest girl, you cannot simply leave again. Stay, you'll be of help to us with the Empire rising in the south. Now that I'm older, you'll peddle me like you did with the Fefneron? That's your own stubbornness. If not that, then answer me one question. All of this for a world that barely hangs on. What would compel you to leave the forest to begin with? If I hadn't, nobody else would have. Yeah, Popel becomes a wanderer. That's pretty awesome. That's a cool conclusion. She goes from world to world. Yeah, it's gonna be hard finding other JRPGs of this caliber made in RPG Maker. Uh, Big Missile Games, is it them? John, Josh Missile did an absolutely great job designing this. Look at all the drawings. The Arak rebuilt their kingdom around the hardened vines that tore apart their own mountain. Their broken mountain still drifts just out of reach, perpetually held in place, always reminding them. Looks like a lot of people actually had a hand in coding this, though. Awesome story. Dialogue sometimes felt a little broken. There were some typos. A few little bugs. I'm sad that the capturing of this game's footage was really laggy. The Bo a boa set out to liberate the naturalists from the aristocracy. He's building Western Aurora into a unified nation with the hope of ultimately bringing his father to justice. Though the empire grows as well, burning as strong as ever. Um, yeah. There were some bugs, there were some dialogue glitches here and there, but nothing that really broke immersion too, too much. Um, I strongly recommend this game. Unfortunately, this game was laggy for me because of OBS. But whenever I play without recording, it was smooth as a... Uh, smooth as something that's very smooth. That's right. The remnants of Goldwood were consumed by trees grown by the throne. It exists in their shadows. Strange things came out of the land underneath when it was torn. Things they'll eventually have to contend with. Am I sad this game is over? Maybe a little bit. I really did enjoy the setting and the characters. But it was getting a little long. And I was excited to see its conclusion. I was excited to see where it was gonna... Where it was gonna go, how it was gonna end. I'm happy to see, uh... An actual ending here instead of just, like, the end. I'd rather not stay, though. Lingering too long in one place is trouble. It may be dangerous beyond Vasca, but I'd like to pass away here. To pass away here? That's what an outsider does, after all. If it comes to it, I'll bury myself. Maybe you'll find Era. Maybe you'll find Evelyn. Or not. The end. Thank you for playing. Well, Joss Mitchell, thank you for making this game. It was an absolute blast. So much fun. I'm sorry I, I ruined the ending. I shouldn't have been that overpowered. But that's that. I strongly recommend this game to you guys. If you've only watched the last episode, 
or only kind of viewed episodes here and there, I strongly recommend this game on Steam. It's not very expensive, and it's quite a lot of fun. So I'm guessing this is going to bring me back to the uh, start screen, but um, so to not have anything weird happen like the game shut down, I'd like to say thank you so much for watching and sticking around till the end. Thank you for liking, thank you for commenting on this game, and thank you for subscribing. I appreciate every single interaction I have with all of you. As always, this is Mr. Gazillion, and I'll see you next time. Bye now. Hey guys, thank you very much for watching my video. I appreciate every single view. If you enjoyed what you watched, feel free to take a look at the next video or peek at a random video. Don't forget to subscribe. See you guys next time.